So few days ago, I made a video in which I talked about how the number of scams have been skyrocketed since pandemic has started. And in that video, I shared about all the top 10 scams which have been happening right now and number of those scams have only increased. And one of the subscribers in that video, in the comment section, he commented and shared his experience about how he was scammed almost like almost seven, eight years ago from now. And he was scammed to the extent that he was feeling depressed. He was feeling suicidal and there, there were so many things which was going through his mind. So today we thought we are going to connect to him face to face and we are going to listen to his experience and he's going to show us all the email proofs he had, all the kind of online typing work he was supposed to do and kind of, you know, how uh, scammers lure you into these scams. And there is already a video uh, made by Carl as well. Carl, along with his wife Manisha, they made a video in which they talked about how housewives also get lured uh, by these scammers and it just wastes their money, time and effort and in return they get nothing. So this sort of work is just, just a scam work and you really need to be aware and you need to be stop being victim of these things okay so let's listen to jan mia experience and now we are going to connect to him have jan mia with us who's going to share his experience uh, with the scammers or and scam jobs okay and uh, i got to know him he's one of the subscriber of my channel as well and i got to know him through the uh, youtube comment which he, which actually he has shared uh, talking about his incident so I thought it will be more intuitive and uh, better if we can connect to him directly and he can share his experience, how students uh, get scammed and how they actually get lured into these kind of uh, scammers. So uh, thank you, Jan Mia, for joining us. Thank you. Thank you so much for uh, uh, doing such videos. And I really like because uh, when you are doing such videos and people will be aware of that. So I don't think uh, no one should lose. Uh, I, no one should lose money because uh, the reason is I just lost my money and no one should fall in that trap and everyone should be saved from the videos which you have done. So it's a really good thing. Yeah. So bro, tell us about like, uh, first, I think just tell us a bit about you. I mean, where. Uh, and just introduce yourself. Uh, probably you can let us know what you like and uh, all those things. Then we will go into you know back of the memory and and we will talk about those incidents which has uh, unfortunate incidents which has happened. Sure, sure. Uh, my name is Jane Mia and uh, I just belong to Andhra Pradesh. And currently I'm working as a junior ML engineer. So this this is simple from my end. Yeah. So you, I mean, more into machine learning and data science. Yeah, and I'm just a very good follower of you. <laughs> so nice to hear that. Um, okay, so I think we can uh, begin with, I mean, I just want to know uh, where you started looking for the jobs and how you get into uh, this, uh, this kind of, you know, scam situation. What was your like, what was uh, going on uh, or going through your mind when you were looking for jobs? Yes, uh, actually, uh, a very big movement happened, a uh, very big incident happened in 2010. So actually, we are uh, just a middle class family and uh, middle or below middle class family. Uh, and in 2010, my father uh, just paralyzed. So suddenly it was happened from there itself. Uh, he's the only income source. So he's the only income generator for our family. And thereafter, uh, from 2010 onwards, it was very tough for us to uh, generate income for our family. So my mother used to do uh, stitching cloth. Uh, so all the saris, everything, so selling saris and stitching all those cloths. So and my grandmother used to get some pension. So with this, we are just getting uh, running our family. And okay. I just joined in my, uh, actually one incident happened when I joined in Inter as well, uh, before going to degree. The major scam was happened in degree and before that also i just met with another scam it is very small but it it was also an experience like uh, i used to see classifieds in newspaper this is happening mm -hmm. uh, 2012. okay so, so all this these happened. i mean it started when you thought of like helping your family because your mom yes. 
uh, she yeah. was like the only you know bread earner so you thought of supporting your family by doing some side income along with your studies right yes absolutely right i'm i'm uh, just planned like that only because even pocket money getting pocket money is very difficult for me and uh, i can see that medication the medicines which required for my father is uh, 6000 rupees at that time because uh, he was paralyzed right so that is all every month it cost 6000 so in 2010 so that is the reason i have to go for uh, any side uh, part time income like that so i just seen a newspaper classified in 2012 then i just contacted him that is a local guy i just contacted him he said to okay. you you come to this city will be meeting mm-hmm. so we'll be arranging meeting you come to that city so he okay. said that before that you need to pay 2000 rupees for that so that you will be getting a slot so i mm-hmm. paid for that uh, then i went okay. for that meeting he first in the introduction itself he said that every month you can earn 10 to 15000 so that okay. uh, it will be very good for students as well so mm-hmm. even housewives or students or whoever want part time job they can do that mm-hmm. so the process is very simple that uh, we'll be sending you uh, some letters so you need to mm-hmm. read that letter and you should follow the guidelines in the letter so okay. we we paid 2000 rupees for that and the next day he said that everyone will get the letter so after that mm-hmm. meeting uh, we went dispersed it is a very small meeting general meeting so mm-hmm. we dispersed and the next uh, t- after two days i think i got a letter from a post i mean uh, post okay. i got it in that a, a clear instruction that you whatever the classified they have given the same mm-hmm. classified we have to give to others and we have okay. to charge 2000 rupees But okay. So it's it like they are like kind of building their organization, right? Yes. So the same thing we need to send them. Then uh-huh. for the classified ad, almost it will be uh, at that time it is around one fifty two hundred rupees. That's it. So okay. classified ad is in newspaper two hundred rupees. For okay. two to three newspapers, it costs around six uh, hundred rupees. Mm-hmm. And uh, so bro, I mean, a- there was no interview, nothing, no uh, quality check or no. uh no standardization so they just they already know that you are going to work and they started their business with you right straight away yes. without without any interview yes bro because uh they they know what our intention is because uh so i think uh, that's the are... that's the first sign of any sort of you know scam which happens they are not going to take a proper interview because they already know that they least care about you or you know uh, whatever knowledge you have or whatever you know whatever things you know they just uh, have some intentions bad intentions which they want to you know you to be a part of you know that yes they encast our situation and uh, we are not in in that situation that we need to check whether it is good or bad so we are in a situation that if we get a little money that's good for our family so in we are in that situation and uh, it didn't work because see if i send if i give classifieds definitely i am going to get some uh, criminal case regarding that with it it is just cheating it's nothing but yeah. that so then i gone through that and uh, it's not the correct way so i just lost my 2000 then i just uh, quit from that and mm-hmm. there after so they, they were they were looking for more like a scapegoat they were mm-hmm. running their business but they wanted to hit behind and wanted you to you know kind of front face and if yeah. if they get caught actually you are the one who are get, going to get caught right yes that is happened and that is a very small thing uh because that's just 2000 loss and later i joined in my degree bca 3 years degree then again the same money problems came more because the degree and need to study books everything all this cost went on in the second year uh, first year somewhat completed in the second year again i was searching for some part time job and i just went for c programming uh, coaching there is a institute okay. in my area i went for c programming coaching there it's mm-hmm. a very big institute uh they just uh, very large room they partitioned the room so i used to see few people sitting and continuously uh, there is a polytechnic college nearby that institute so girls used to come okay. there to learn autocad uh, all these courses i have no idea about polytechnic so they used to come and learn and uh, i don't know I, i just thought that they are learning but one day i asked with my curiosity that i have uh, what they are doing so i just asked the person who is dealing with that so he said that uh, they are doing a part time job okay how okay. much they are paying he said 5000 they are paying for that monthly 5000 mm-hmm. they are paying for that then i i was very interested so it it will help for me then i went and i spoke with them. then they told that uh, actually the process is that they paid 1 lakh for that it's a uh, work from home concept typing uh, okay. they will be giving text and they need to type 
so mm-hmm. it was went like that and they paid 1 mm-hmm. lakh for that they have given 10 software licenses or mm-hmm. keys they have given 10 keys okay so so for uh, each project once they will complete they will be getting around 18 to 20 20000 but depending okay. upon the text for each license mm-hmm. key if you type every month they will be getting 18 to 20000 okay so uh, the, this was this is happened in 2014 exactly 2014 this is happened so mm-hmm. the then later i just spoke them i do need that uh, i'll be also doing the job then they said that the slots were filled everyone are doing so okay. you please uh, you wait if someone don't come to the job then we'll be filling that with you then i mm-hmm. said okay then i waited and after few days that who is the person who gave them the software he came to the institute then okay. accidentally i met with him and we have some few words uh, with him then he said that okay i'll be giving you the software i explained mm-hmm. my situation to him this is situation can you give me the software i'll be working from home so he said that okay i'll be giving i'll be coming to your home and i'll be giving to you so we, i invited him to my home then he came to my home then he is mm-hmm. seen my father situation he still my father can't walk at that time 2014 also he can't walk he's just uh, sleeping on bed only so he spoke with my father then he said actually individual software cost is 15000 with license key single license key but mm-hmm. seeing your situation i am giving you for 13500 so okay. we bargained but he said that no no that is the lowest cost i am giving offering you uh, mm-hmm. less than that i cannot give you so okay uh, monthly if we are getting once we will buy license key it is it, it can hold for 6 months license key will be okay. valid for 6 months 6 months okay. so yeah 13000 okay every month we will be getting around 20000 right 6 month uh, it will be 1 lakh 20000 we expected like that we calculated in that way and we said okay, okay. then we he said that single payment we need to pay then my father uh, just got money uh, for some outside and we paid that somehow we paid mm-hmm. that 13500 for mm-hmm. one week i think he didn't give us a software anything for one mm-hmm. week uh, he didn't give us software i called many times then he said okay uh, i was a little busy with other people so i'll be sending you the software some he sent me the software in mail so i just okay. installed that and uh, he given us the zip folders in okay. each zip folder uh, actually he sent us the license key everything in mail and okay. then he he will send he will send one zip file uh, each zip file will be around 20 to 25 uh, text files i think so text or okay. uh, some somewhat uh, i think word files or i don't know exactly what is the format mm. i think some sort of image files which you have to convert into ah. text files yes image files i think so maybe that uh, image i think so so we cannot copy that because we need mm-hmm. just type we cannot copy that lines right right each each file will be around uh, 100 files uh, 100 mm-hmm. lines each file will be 100 lines he will be sending mm-hmm. 20 to 25 so it okay. depends upon that month data so okay. he used to send and he is just uh, put some constraints that um, not hun- more than 100 mistakes will be rejected right If right type right 100 mistakes you will be typing that that uh, that month's project will be rejected they will right. they will i think just i just want to add one point here so i mean i have seen all these kind of in all these kind of you know online time uh, typing jobs and scams so they will tell you or they will give you very high level of you know accuracy to achieve like you should be achieving 95% of accuracy and the problem here is they don't uh, they are not transparent so they don't know you which mistakes you made you know which which are the mistakes which you have made so they just uh, tell you that okay you made many mistakes and it was less than 95% accurate so we are going to reject and we are not going to pay you for this month yes but uh, <clears throat> actually they have given me they said not percentage in in terms of percentage they have given me in terms of um, six words word count only so more okay. uh, if more than 100 then straight away it will be rejected so till mm-hmm. 100 okay but more than 100 it will be rejected so okay. if you see that uh, text file right uh, actually we cannot go with that because uh, some it is not that much clarity so it mm-hmm. is like a little blur everything it, it was there uh, if you okay i can show you that everything details with me there yeah, yeah. i think so, it will be good you can show us uh, the details later on probably or now that, that's okay sure i can show i'll be uh, sharing the screen for you mm mm-hmm. Can you can you see my screen? Yeah, it's it's yeah, we can see the screen now. Yeah. 
so it was like uh, uh, actually solutions for you you can see the okay. event uh, on left side i think so you can see the dates so it happened right, in 2014 right. yeah i can see that so i'll be showing uh, here it is activation key so i'll hmm. be okay sorry so i mean they uh, they pretended to be genuine and they sent you the software they sent you the keys they sent you the you know all the uh, images which you have to convert into text yeah so this is the license key uh, the number they have given to me this is sent uh, even after uh, many days i contacted him after one week so till one week he said i'll send today tomorrow today tomorrow it, it went like okay. that and later uh, uh, after i am uh, i called many times then i told that when will you send i asked uh, seriously then he sent to me that i'll show you that uh, i had a file data file so i got some software as well he sent i don't know exactly uh -huh. where it is yeah but yeah i think I, i i got the idea and everyone have got the idea so i mean they I'll basically show you uh, a screen yeah yes somewhere this is i'll show you here it is okay so uh, if you can see me see yeah it can, is yeah i can I'll see the folder <clears throat> Yeah. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Okay. So if I zoom it, it will be like this. Oh. Wow. So <laughs> I think it's <laughs> so blurry and there is so many things going on. Yes. Wow. Uh, I think I don't is, know. Is this one document or one page? Because it, it has so many things like compacted and compressed into like uh, to look it like to make it look a small document. But I see so many things and so many words being written. This is a uh, hundred lines, I think. So more than hundred lines it is. So they'll be sending uh, twenty twenty-two to twenty-five uh, documents like this. So we need to type, okay. and time constraint is eighteen days. Okay. <clears throat> so within eighteen days, you have to like twenty-five <clears throat> to thirty files. You have to submit them, right? Submit them. Yes, correct. And, uh, so I need to submit them. Each for each file or overall file. I mean, the number of mistakes uh, which you told should not be more than hundred. Was it for all the thirty documents Enter. or for each file? Enter, Enter document. So Enter I mean, document. out of that thirty thirty files, and each file has like one hundred lines. And I guess each line has so many words, and you have to make only one hundred words mistake, right? I that mean, is, this uh, is uh, the so probability. Stupid. Yes, the probability to lose myself is ninety nine percent. The probability right. to win for him is hundred percent. Right, I can see that. that I mean, that's what happened. That, Thank you so just, much for uh, sharing this information, bro. Yeah, so th that's what uh, when you done that uh, first video. Just I remembered all mm -hmm. those things. Are why that happened? This is very good video. Mm -hmm. Most of the people need to watch because uh, recently the things are going on. Still, there things are going on. uh they'll be yeah, paying, these, these uh, things are don't stop yes and uh, i i just missed one thing that the institute which i told you that they have taken they have paid 1 lakh or 1 lakh 20000 i don't know they have paid that and they have taken 10 ids uh okay. this guy has paid uh for two to three systems every month like uh, mm -hmm. uh, around uh, 30000 they are, used to pay okay 30 to 40000 i think so he paid two to three systems the remaining mm -hmm. went all wrong because they have okay. no experience the, everything went uh -huh. wrong from 10 ids seven ids went wrong three three people has done correctly he paid that first month and from second month he used to pay only one one system because rest of the things were not completed in time and there are more than 100 mistakes and third uh -huh. month he just disappeared simply disappeared so he uh -huh. lost 1 lakh 1 lakh 20000 i think so he lost that amount so this okay. this is what happened hmm and how much money you lost i mean through this scam Yeah, through this scam, thirteen thousand five hundred is lost. And apart from that, there is uh, hidden charges. So, like mm. uh, I used to pay. I can uh, because I'm studying uh, at right. that time. I'm yeah. studying and only half day college. So morning mm. I used to go, and one one of my B uh, B S C electronic friends used to come morning time because he's afternoon session. So he used to come my home. He used to mm. do that work for me. and he is to i have to pay him every month uh, at least i will i promise him i will be paying 3000 rupees per month so okay. for doing that job. i think bro you so can I now probably you can stop sharing the screen uh, so we can see you on the full screen oh fine and
Yeah. So, okay. I mean, uh, obviously, other than this, there is so much, you know, trauma and things which you have uh, gone through because, uh, you know, you are putting so much effort and you don't, you are just, you know, being a victim of one of the, you know, people who are making these or doing such sort of crimes. Yes. So a lot of pressure I have undergone because I cannot concentrate on my education in the class. I cannot concentrate because uh, there is a lot of work to do in home because I need to submit the project within 18 days. And, uh, there is uh, like uh, I, all my concentration is on this project only because uh, there is almost deadlines and mistakes everything uh, i don't i not even i concentrated on my subjects so second year entirely education was dropped percentage percentage was dropped so that and i said hidden charges right every month i used to get 5000 electric charge bill every uh, approximately mm -hmm. 4500 mm -hmm. like that and for three months, I used to get like that only. Three months, the project I have taken. Three months, I used to get 15,000 uh, electricity bill. And I have to pay 3,000 for uh, this guy who is coming and sharing my mm. work. So there I have lost 9,000. And all this went up. So I just borrowed money from outsiders. So I didn't say to my family members because uh, there is already the, we have a lot of pressures at home. We have problems mm. at home. Mm. And uh, all these things just uh, made me to I, in one situation i just thought why i am leaving should i uh, do yeah. anything a suicide I shouldn't say that yeah. but in, yeah. in i mean that I, I can imagine i mean they they pushed you so much and you like you have a lot of family you know uh, financial burden because you want to you know do something for your family you want to support them on top of them you are losing you know in all all those money and you had to borrow money from outsiders and there, there will be so many things going on to your mind, right? It's yes. more like a blocked situation. You don't know what to do and things are not improving. And probably, you know, those kind of things starts to come into the mind. Yeah. So how so then, that, how things got better and how you, I mean, what what is next? So the next thing is that uh, the Facebook saved me much, uh, really, uh, because the Facebook advertisements. Uh, so I have uh, just uh, went for using Facebook advertisements. At that time, mm -hmm. I just asked the local merchants so to do some uh, ad ads on Facebook so that more people will be reaching better than local ad TV ads. So I uh, reached them. I have shown them the uh, analytics which uh, the previous ads worked for me. So around seventy to eighty thousand, I just. Uh, uh, came uh, the advertisement fees everything I have uh, just collected seventy to eighty thousand and uh, I have a few guys who work for me have just paid for them mm -hmm. and uh, the remaining amount I just borrowed amount I have just paid back and later mm -hmm. I concentrated from third year and uh, mm -hmm. I selected for uh, I campus placement I have selected for TCS so okay. th but later I have changed my mind for uh, I just uh, got rank one in Ralsima University for data science. So I just left to my job. I'm so happy for you that things have improved. And so, I mean, how do you, I mean, I know there are a lot of students who want to support their family or want to support their education. Um, what are the tips you will give and how they can identify such sort of, you know, scam companies or, and how they can stop being the victim? Yes, uh, there are a lot of things that uh, first one can know that, that if there is any uh, typing jobs or work from home job, they'll be asking to pay money first to register your slot. See, that there is nothing like that. If we are we are working for you, then you are right. paying us at the end of the work. So the result right. which we give to you, you are paying for us. So why should we pay uh, before we are doing the work? Because you are right. so not now, the one who paid to us. Right. So I mean, that's correct this. point because I have also been working like some 10 years. I, I don't see any legitimate company which is asking money from the candidate upfront. I mean, that's the first sign of a scam company. Yeah, everyone will ask that. Uh, if the scam company is there, everyone will ask. Uh, so you need to pay, you need to register your slot, everything. And few people will say that, uh, I mean, uh, there are a few websites who tells us that. So that we are getting a lot of applications. So prefer uh, we'll be preferring your application if you book your slot with paying this much money. So this is not going to work and this is not genuine as well. Maybe if there are any few companies, uh, I. I don't know, but exactly mm -hmm. what I come across is all, all of these scams itself. Yeah. So better yeah. it will be doing a freelancing, everything that might work for you. Uh, mm. But uh, these kind of things is not going to work. Yeah. And uh, did you take any action? I mean, uh, did you think of filing a police complaint or, or doing any uh, such sort of things? 
to close these yeah, kind of it, companies i tried i tried to ask him because i uh, i called him uh, to come to my home because we do we had a uh, ramzan month on that uh, on that month so on that first festival i called him to come my home i'll be uh, serving you the food for as festival so i asked mm-hmm. him he didn't come many times uh, he used to ask me to drop somewhere else because he used to go to uh, his home his home is near my home only i mean uh, two okay. to three uh, the area near that area only but he mm-hmm. don't disclose that so okay. so he used to hide everything from that and i thought okay mm-hmm. maybe some uh, privacy problems okay i just take took casual but later mm-hmm. uh, i had to pay for that okay and bro i mean you just told that your parents were you know you didn't tell your parents that time so how is it now have you told your parents because if we upload it on youtube there is chance you know they may come across uh, this yeah thing. i just uh, explained everything after when i bought that facebook money that i have went through ads so after earning that money then i just uh, revealed everything uh, so this okay. is this is what happened so this is what okay. happened i used to tell them that he used to pay me after 4 months 5 months he is mm-hmm. taking time because uh, for a lot of people there are in queue he is paying like that so i used okay. to tell them i used to hide that things but yeah, uh, later on we play because again their parents i mean your your mother is only at that time they yeah. were she was doing a lot and you you didn't want to put you know or tell all these things uh, to her yeah. otherwise she might get more you know uh, anxiety or depressed yeah i was very depressed uh, more than my mom because i uh, i had all those details from her of my family i, I had all those details and uh, i don't know whom should i share with i mean i have no person to share with me because all these things uh, 13500 for us at that time 2014 very big amount yeah very big amount right right especially when you need the money you don't you know have any money And at that time, even spending one rupee is, you know, yeah. it's, it's a big amount. Thirteen thousand five hundred. I can only imagine. I mean, how much the things you have gone through. Yeah, that is just an amount which uh, will look. Uh, I can view that amount, but the hidden charges like the power bills, yeah. the paying those guy, yeah. everything. So it was yeah. almost thirty thousand. Adding, adding all those mental stress and all those things. I mean, yeah. this is too much. So, Around thirty thousand. Right. Okay, I think now, bro. I mean, uh, I really wish you good luck. That things are things have smoothen and things are going to go well from here. Okay, and thank you so much for sharing your experience. I, you know, I would really like to see that you know people they learn from this video and also they share their experiences, especially when they are going through any this kind of situation. Uh, I mean, obviously they can, they can, they should reach people and they should seek help and they should tell. Okay, this is a you know stress or things I'm going through. rather than keeping to yes. themselves right uh, definitely i will tell one thing to the youth because most of the youth only will trap uh, will get trapped in this uh, this kind of jobs so right. i will suggest them one thing that uh, please don't go for this kind of things even there is nothing like that if there is anything they'll be providing the details to any uh, software company to complete the work right. even uh, all this right. kind of will be some legally done through yeah. some uh, procedure a professional procedure will be there they'll be right. doing that so because uh, we do some uh, we do nlp like a uh, image uh, we are getting extracting data from image if i had that knowledge then definitely i would have done that in 20 years <laughs> right. probably data. you you had known python you would be extracting yeah. data with 100% accuracy and i yes. guess you know still they would have told okay uh, this this is not accurate because uh, yes. eventually they are running a scam company right scam company they don't provide us the uh, quality data the data will be some messy something and the cl- cl- image clarity also won't be there then we will be getting mm-hmm. suffered with that so don't go with that i suggest all mm-hmm. the youth pe- youth and who are there who is getting trapping in this don't believe that they will be paying us why do they pay there are lot of softwares available now they will be extracting the data and filling the data so it is not uh, it's not going to work for everyone and you will be feeling depressed and recently mm-hmm. we have job not much jobs so don't get fall in this trap and lose much more money yeah there there is no such thing as easy money if somebody is giving you easy money it's no. uh, most probably it's a scam thing right yes that is scam definitely that is scam because uh, no one will t- uh, see who is going to give us a job now if suppose if i go for any software company so no one will tell that Uh, okay, there are a lot of interviewers. Uh, I mean, uh, persons who is coming for interview. You just register your slot with giving us money. 
is there anything mm-hmm. like that there is nothing like that that will be in a professional way you do the work then we will be letting you will be get paid so similarly everything should be in that manner because why we need to register the slot if we are in necessity of money uh, so we are working for you you give at the end of the project so that is the thing okay bro i mean thank you so much thank you so much for and sharing your experience thank you so experience. much and one request from uh, from my end is that please upload some python videos a really big fan of you yeah, bro. and that <laughs> telegram api i think just it worked very well for me superb and whatsapp whatsapp also you have done a video that also worked very well so do this kind of thing i am very much interested yeah. to learn all this thank you so much stuff. bro i mean i'll be share, yeah i mean initially when i started actually i thought nobody is you know watching this and i'm not really getting much views i think there is no demand for that sort of videos but yes. you know when like you you started reaching and now i see you know lots of comments that people are saying that you know videos are helpful it is helping them in their project and it is helping them to do their business or whatever the side thing they want to learn so yes i will i will continue doing all those stuff now Yes. definitely your channel will be growing and i am be supporting that and i uh, definitely will be sharing to everyone is necessary